guys welcome back to the channel today what we're gonna do is teach you how to make some fire starters hashtag camp challenge alliance this is my february make something that can be used at camp so i got i've been looking online and trying to figure out now i'm not the first to ever do this of course other people are doing this but I don't know that anybody is gonna do it the way I'm trying to do it so they say use candle wax and my thought is let me get this out we're almost there be a little tricky part at first there we go now what we have here citrus nellis I can't even pronounce it right candle which is really good for keeping the mosquitoes away. So if we're gonna start a campfire, it might be kind of neat to try this out if this is a, works for the fire starter. I'm gonna try this a couple different ways. So we got some broken up. We got some right here broken up. Put it right in there. And try not to drop it. Which of course we did. And I don't know if this is a good idea to be trying this inside the house. I'm only going to do a little bit because I just don't know. This might be a bad idea. So it's moving down awful quick. I'm gonna try this a couple different ways. Here is cotton rounds. You can get this in the women's department for makeup. All they are is cotton. And now what I seen is that you can make them like this. Just take a little bit of this. Petroleum and sandwich them together like this. These are easy, cheap ways to make fire starters. So, right here. do four of them like this there we go and I'm gonna have to turn this off here in a second it's just about done I do now this actually will make 40 of these and this is only like a dollar or eighty. I'm gonna have to shut this off. I'm gonna do Just 
Just let that sit. Cool. Now you can do it either way. This is an experiment because I've never heard of it being, they say use candle wax, but this is citron, citrus vanilla uh, to keep mosquitoes away. So we're gonna do a few that are using the citrus vanilla candle, which I think you're gonna be able to tell apart. And all this was was an old candle that I was gonna throw away anyways, because it had burnt down so far. So, So we have four of them like this. Four of them like this. And I'm gonna do four just with petroleum jelly. Hashtag Camp Challenge Alliance. Guys, get in to Camp Challenge Alliance. Start sharing some challenges along with the group there. So I'm just going to do a couple little test runs because I'm not sure. These, I know for a fact, should start from all the stuff that I've researched. And this right here is a fire starting ferro rod that I got from my good friend Dave Calliard's camping. I'm going to throw him in the description so you can go check his channel out. He's a pretty cool dude and I haven't even had a chance to test but I'm going to test this out and we're going to try to light them but not inside the house. Well in case you guys were wondering what I had this little tin for. It's just for store, storing these in my backpack. So we'll try the ones that are first. Ones will be the ones with just the uh, petroleum jelly. And I'm gonna stick that in there. Like that. Get this barrel rod out that I got from Dave Colliard's camping. Now this has never been used, so it might take a second. Bell, get over here. Where you at? Stay over here. This may be a tad tricky. I've never used this one before, and it's not even broken in. I like it that it's, everything's kept together. There we go. Now that one right there is just the petroleum jelly and the cotton disc. And look, it's taken off. And the first time I've ever used this, and what I found out with this here ferro rod is, now I'm forgetting. Stay over here, Lou. Well, I think it's because it's too tight right here. Come over here. What I want to do is I'm going to try that one. I think you're supposed to let them cool all the way. This one, if it lights, which I don't know if it will, it should. It just has uh, candle wax, citronella. So let's see what citronella. It worked. There we go. Round two, finally. 
the citrus snella. Let's see what we got here. And I still have the two regular cotton ones right here. So I think that the citrus snella with the petroleum jelly and these little discs should burn longer and keep the mosquitoes away. Ah, perfect, perfect, perfect. This ferro rod has not been broken in yet. We're just starting to break it in. So it'll start working a heck of a lot better. Especially once I get it broken in. And my hands ain't so slippery from using the petroleum jelly and getting some of it on my hands. Here's another one of those discs that is uh, citrus nella and uh, petroleum jelly. And these can make be these fire starters can be made dirt cheap too because a pack of 80 of these were only like a dollar fifty dollar seventy I think with taxes something like that I don't know dollar fifty dollar seventy and the petroleum jelly was only like a buck fifty and the candle I was gonna pitch it it was already all wore down so I've never seen them done with citrus nella for the fire starter, so I figured I would try something different and see if it worked. I didn't even know if it'd work, melting it down. It's a little tricky to get started. It seems like it burns longer, too. We got a nice little fire going. Hashtag Camp Challenge Alliance. Join today. Do your first video. Guys, each month they got a, a new challenge. And it's very family oriented. So, like, I think the month of January is do uh, camp inside. Uh, because, you know, the weather's really bad in January. And not everybody wants to go and do hot tent camping outdoors or hang out in the ice cold unless you're crazy like me and then you might go in minus 25 but for people that just want to have fun and and do some camping act uh, you know like he said in the video he said let your childhood memories take you away and do your thing but yeah, this little container right here is just for putting these in. And I probably should have lit these here first before trying to stuff them in there. I probably had better luck. Got a nice little fire going. Pad's working pretty good. Here's another one of them. This one is Citrus Nella too. There we go. Well, my opinion is it's a success and they burn slow. 
the citrus snow is the way to go. And it'll keep the mosquitoes away. Like I said, that has citrus snow and petroleum jelly and the cotton pad. And look at how it's it's burning pretty good. And it's not burning real fast. So this is a dirt cheap way of making a fire starter. And I want to say thanks again to Dave Callard's Camping for this here barrel rod. I was a little rough getting it broken in, but we keep working at it. We'll get a little bit better. Guys, thanks for watching, and we'll catch you at the next one. And what my boy Michael would say, cut.